It's a sign of things to come, Hauraki District Council, on a mission to incorporate more te reo into its day-to-day -day dealings. It's Māori Language Week, Te Wiki o Te Reo Māori, and we're using this as an opportunity to start practising and growing our te reo. So we are using the approach of taking small steps or baby steps and just learning uh, to begin with some few simple phrases and, uh, and kupu or words uh, and trying to apply that to everything we do. Mayor John Tregida wants his council and residents to speak and understand more of Te Reo. Really good opportunity for us to take a lead as council to actually start getting that language out there and normalising it I, I think. And it's about much more than just changing a few signs. The more we use it, more we'll become more proficient at it. It's a cultural initiative starting from the ground up, with Te Reo now also integrated into toddler time in the area's libraries. Ma is white. We look forward to it every Monday. Green. He learns it at daycare as well, so it's going to be well established, I'd like to think, before he goes to school. It's great to be able to just put in those basic words like the colours and the parts of the body and that sort of thing. It's really just a starter, as far as I see it, for them to then go on. Everyone's learning te reo, from toddlers to the mayor and councillors. Morena, kei te pehe koe. What have you been learning? Uh, oh, and how's Hauraki, so we say Hauraki where it should be? Hauraki. Hauraki. If you'd like to teach it, it's ho ducky, and you say it quickly, Hauraki. Hauraki. Instead of Hauraki, Hauraki. While there's still some more learning to be done, locals are full of praise for this forward-thinking council. I think it's a good thing that the council is investing in uh, a multicultural New Zealand, especially a multicultural pyro. Core Hunter Quarter Tine, Local Focus.